going on everybody? Double A here, and today we're going over another Hitman 3 video. This map is Dartmoor, and we're doing the Percival Passage Escalation, level 3, in under 5 minutes. What you want to do is you want to follow right off the bat this path here so you don't get seen. Um, full disclosure, you are going to need to have one ladder open from doing this mission, mission to do this the correct way. Uh, and I'll tell you how to do that here when we get to it. So you want to make sure you get around all these guards without alerting anybody. Run up these steps. Go over it. You're going to climb the uh, drainage spout over here up the side of the building. And then uh, walk on the platform alongside the building all the way around. Now as you run over here and vault over this, you are going to start to get a yellow alert bar there. Don't worry about it, the guy will not see you. Just continue moving and climb up. Uh, once you get over here, you're going to be able to climb up this other water spout and go up to a little platform. This is where you need to have that ladder down. Uh, after we go up the ladder, I'll explain how to knock it down in the mission. And this ladder cuts a ton of time off. So what you want to do to knock down the ladder is basically the reverse of what I'm doing right now. You need to hang on this ledge from the stairway during a regular mission and shimmy over, go through the window, and you need to have a crowbar on you. You can get the crowbar over by the greenhouse before you run up here and assassinate Alexa. So once you grab the shotgun up there, make your way down to this first target right here. You want to wait till the target right behind me there starts moving towards the other target. So he starts walking. Now you can pop this guy in the head. So. Then a quick sprint over here because people are going to come in that other door. Go ahead. You can get both these guys in one shot. I messed up. It takes me two. But boom, boom. Run over here. You want to duck down beside this door because the people on the right are going to come out and find those other two dead bodies. You want to be paying attention to the guy on your left here, your next target. As soon as he puts his weapon away, you are safe to run over there and vault over that and slide down the uh, drain pipe over there and go over and knock him off. So boom, jump it, grab the pipe, slide down it like a stripper. Go ahead and uh, make your way past the window. And... Uh, Luckily in England here, they don't pay attention to red coats because you're just walking alongside a building in a red coat. And nobody, nobody even sees you. Uh, you do have to drop down here and crawl past this tree to vault back up over. Uh, one thing you could probably do better here is maybe shoot this guy from the side instead of in the back of the head like I do because it does call him to fall down. Uh, may save you from alerting a couple more people. Now this next guy here, this is a tricky one because he's in the room with another person. So... You could probably save yourself some time right here, too. Instead of waiting for him to walk back, you're going to alert the guys anyway when you shoot him. You could probably just sprint through here. I waited until he walked over to the window. So there he goes, walking to the window. Then uh, go ahead and go in here. Up to him. Bop, that's target number five. Now you're just sprinting. You could probably jump out that window you just killed him at and shimmy around um, while they're looking for you in there. You may not get shot at, but you can run right past them and slide down this pole like a stripper too. And uh, as you go over here, these guys are already alerted because I knocked that other guy off the ledge when I shot him. So you need to kind of make your way out to the left here, like I'm going to do in a second. Sprint over into the bushes. Luckily, only one of the people over here is a security guard. The other two, they're going to have to run to the security guard to tell them when they see you anyway. So, 
As soon as he starts to walk, just make your dash for the exit, and you are free and clear. So if this video helped you out, please hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this from Hitman 3, subscribe to the channel. We're going to keep knocking these out. Thank you guys, and have a great one.